Hello and welcome to this week's Cat Out the Chateau and we haven't had one for a couple of weeks because we were away in Scotland yeah. and I've also been getting used to doing the almost dailies uh, Chateau Diaries from Sunday through to Thursday and trying to get used to all of the editing needed for that. So I'm actually really excited we get to eat so some I. lovely parcels today. Well do you want to start with one? Yes please. All right so. so this one I mean it's open so you can already see what it is but it didn't come with a note or a name. We don't know who it's from. We don't have an email. Fabulous. So I don't know who sent this, but it is a great book. Brilliant English gardens. This is wonderful. Maybe there's nothing inside. But there's no uh, name or anything like it, no. Oh my goodness, this but is beautiful. But the pictures, look at that. Oh. <gasps> is it mainly photos of the gut? Oh, well, this is going to be so much inspiration. Right. It's the perfect coffee table book, isn't it? I love it. It's the the coffee table book to rule all other coffee table books. I want to sit down with Davy and just like go through oh, with yes. him, looking at this. You're gonna make a wish list for the absolutely. The I mean, look at that little moan path through this slightly it's wild it's field. Gosh. It's cautious. <laughs> it's cautious. <laughs> wow. And that's in. I mean, that's the season we're nearing, right? See, if we ever had a swimming pool. I want it to look like this, so that it looked like a garden pond and was quite mm. dark. Like I like that. Actually, a swimming pool. Maybe after the uh, Castle on the Channel Country, the library. The <laughs> yes. So it's good to dream. A lake. If yes. we didn't dream, we wouldn't be here in the first place. That is place. true. That is very true. Oh, that's beautiful. I know. Oh, but wait for this. Magnolia. Stunning. Okay, sorry. I better put this aside, otherwise we won't open it. anything else. But I love it. Absolutely love it. Well, whoever sent it, thank yes. you so much. Whoever this is from, thank you. This is going to give us hours of joy. So the next gift is quite I small. I think that we should have kept this one on the floor. It's I quite funny see seeing it next to your head. Thank you, because it is just my head that you can see. Yes. Well, I see there's one for Natty. There's so many gifts in here for lots of people. Oh, they're beautifully wrapped. From Jay and Ziggy. So let's see if Ooh. I can find a letter. Yes, 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 yes. I see. Is that, is that a squirrel tail that I see? Let's find out. Can I spot a squirrel? Oh, oh yes that it is. That is an excellent squirrel. Do you want to expect I was like? not expecting that specific squirrel, no. <gasps> oh, look at the dog. To Stephanie, Philip and the Lalonde family. It's been a while since Ziggy and I have been in touch, so here are a few gifts and treats for you and the Chateau family. Oh, I've had great pleasure in finding gifts for you all, and I hope you like them as much as I do. Ziggy also wanted to include some pictures of what he's been up to. All our love. Jay and Ziggy. That so, is an excellent outfit. Dad got me a new outfit for the Jubilee. <laughs> Very important. There he is again in the Jubilee outfit. Oh. My modelling headshot. Um, watch out for me on the front cover of Pooch Vogue. <laughs> oh, this is an excellent toy. What a lucky boy I was to get all these toys for Christmas. So cute. So many. Me and Dad waiting for our best programme to start. Chateau Diaries. So nice to see a photo of you. This might be my favourite, actually. Oh, Dad that's... said I looked good. I think, I, like, I look, I'm going to a funeral. Oh. No, he looks like it's, it's proper evening Very wear. dapper, yeah, yes. Evening wear. <gasps> Anyone for God? Me hearing a crisp packet opening. <laughs> <laughs> I think we are exactly the same, aren't we? This would have been good in Scotland. Dad oh, yes. bow ties. And here we have an excellent tie. A baby pic of me on my first day at doggy school. Oh. If we ever got a dog, would we get little bow ties for him? So cute. Well, to stop it, Philip. <laughs> me posing in our freshly painted room. Michael Petherick chose the colour as oh. I couldn't decide. And the last one. Oh, no. <laughs> no, the best is for last. Guarding Dad's antiques. Mm. We do, very I think we do need a dog like that, that, don't we? This is the best. Me oh. trying a new style. <laughs> oh, that's fabulous. It looks a little bit like I Isabel. Know. I mean, I don't know. What... <gasps> no, but with the, the clip in the hair, you know, like... The, the... Oh, you're going to be in so Not with the trouble. tongue, but with the hair. Not with the tongue. That's the bit that you're worried about. <laughs> Not the bow tie either. <laughs> no, but it looks like... <laughs> you know what I mean. I exactly what you mean. I just hope mummy does. <laughs> See who are these for? So this is for. I think we can open this one. Okay. I'll, I'll take out the ones that we can open. All right. And then I'll put the box on the ground. Good. I can't believe this. 
And we've taken out the gifts for Mummy, Amory and Natty. It's a, it's a pile. I can't believe it. So a lot of them are for the house and some okay. are for me and you. All right. And this one says, this is for me. To Stephanie, a little something for your collection. Oh. Which collection, I wonder? What do you think it is? It's Don't definitely know. ceramics, right? It's definitely ceramics. This is a very special one for you. Shall I start with this Okay. <gasps> oh my God, that's a Bernardo set. That's a Elizabeth Bernardo set, yes, no? Yes, it is Bernardo et compagnie. Service exécuté pour la réception yeah. de la reine Elisabeth à l'occasion de sa visite en France. Yeah. So Bernardo, the service made for the reception of Queen Elizabeth of England on the occasion of her visit to France in April 1957. We have one plate that's one broken. Plate and it's cracked, which yeah. is the only way I could afford to buy yes. it. Um, just as a sort of memento, a historical thing to show people when they're looking at the porcelain at La Lande. We paid like 10 euros. This is a perfect little espresso cup perfect do you have espresso on that later yes 100 percent. good thank you that's a beautiful set was it ziggy who picked it out probably You've got excellent taste i can tell thank you wow so let's see what these ones so are there's so much more oh. oh that's beautiful steph oh you've got a few of them on your desk oh look at yes i do it's hand painted little, by little the way. roses inside yeah it's limoges as well gosh I love it. Okay, that's going to go on my dressing table. They're so useful for keeping little things you don't know where to like put. Like hair ties. Hair ties. Do you hear the wind? I know it's howling outside. <laughs> but I like putting um, safety pins in them. Really useful Excellent. For safety pins. Mm. Oh, 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 that's beautiful. Gold that is stunning. I love them with a the gold ring. And it's spode. There's been an old one. It's then. a very old one because I haven't seen this before. I love it. Oh, okay, I'll open the rest. All right. I've been unpacking the sauces and I didn't for a minute. Oh my goodness. Perfect saucer for it. And look at these. For a start, I love this type of very shallow saucer mm -hmm. with a perfect scene on it and no ridge. Yes. Gorgeous. And there's both of these as well. Beautiful. They're so elegant. This is going to be my little espresso cup just for me ever more i think i will be having uh espressos daily after dinner now oh, will you? yes i think so good to know just because of the cup actually more <laughs> than anything else a bit of exotic kitchen camo to remind you of your travels oh. i'm super excited i love spode blue. i saw indian sporting oh, i love indian oh. sporting is one of my favorites it's one of the oldest Look ones as well that excellent they're off probably on a tiger hunt but the good thing about this one is there are no tigers being harmed on this mug. We They're like just, that. Just off on an elephant. Just chilling on an elephant. What a fabulous mug. I love it. Love it. I can't believe it. What a day. I love the boxes as well because they're very they're elegant. Really great. They're really great. So this says, maybe I'm a bonbonniere or maybe I'm a trinket box. You decide. Mm. The Manufacture Royale de Limoges. Mm. Oh my goodness. That is stunning. Oh God, look at that. Just stunning. The quality of the print is beautiful. Oh. 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 It almost looks like a golden frame around it. I love it. I think that in the winter salon with mm. chocolates in. I think bonbonniere. Yeah. Because you'd want to look at that and open up and find a chocolate. Oh, and there's some information about the pattern. Andrea Casali. 1720 to 1784. Le sacrifice de Sophonisbe. The sacrifice of Sophoniste. The private collection of Hela and Isom Fares. To look Gosh. that up. It's wonderful. I love how we always learn something, okay? Every time. That's it. I will have to look up yeah. the painting. It's just so rich in detail. Mm. You'd be drawn to that from the other side of the room. <laughs> hoping for chocolates but i love the side imagine that on a table with that side i'm saying it almost looks like the, like the golden frame around the painting it is it's wonderful i absolutely love it next we have from bali to la land mm. so this has come a long way <laughs> said necklace oh, yes i'm gonna put it on straight away your mother it's has something like that way. my mother loves turquoise mm. absolutely loves it it's magnificent. The beads are really interesting, the way they sort of like fit together. I quite like it, yes. It's very geometric. Oh, it's just it's really gorgeous. Cool. And this one, 
I think my mother is going to um, show a very, very strong interest <laughs> in this. The colours! Yeah. Oh, it's beautiful. Mm, dreaming of warm holidays. Look at such a beautiful sheen to it, you know? I love it. It is gorgeous. But if I keep this on, then we can't see the necklace, so it's one or the other. <laughs> a special addition to the kitchen. Ooh. It's a commemoration mug for Queen Elizabeth, but you've got to see how it's done. Oh. Isn't that oh, gorgeous? That is really cute. And then there. Oh, is that? Yeah, that's the Spode one. And in fact, we have the Spode commemoration plate yes. for King Charles III in the kitchen, so that can go near it. Oh, but this, it's <laughs> honestly, this side's great, but this is the heartbreak. It's a nice size. Like, there's a nice um, size of mug as well. That's really nice. But this, I just love this. It's very cute. You've been so thoughtful. I can't believe the things that you found. Just It's all perfectly so perfect. suited to the land. Yeah. Absolutely perfect for those cool summer evenings on the terrace. Ooh. How Or oh, your favourite birds for your favourite season. Well, hopefully they'll keep me warm on those cool autumn eating evenings as well, which is pretty much what the you're The colours are stunning. Look at that. It's so soft. Philip, you've got to feel that. It's so soft. It is really soft. That's stunning. Oh, I love it. I absolutely love it. Yeah, that might... This is going to be quite a staple, mm. I think, actually. For both of us. Yeah, I know you're going to love <laughs> this one too. You haven't seen what Philip's wearing. There, there, imagine that. See? It's not exactly the same shape. No, but it's just, it's but your colours, isn't it? It's very it? isn't it? <laughs> it's so soft. It is a bit chilly in here today, I'll be honest. It's just starting now to get a bit colder in the house. Hopefully the heating will be working for Yes. Soon. This is, what's more regal than an eagle? Oh. Set of candle somethings. I can't read the next word. We'll find out. Candlesticks? It's talons. Whoa. Oh. Look at that. Oh, gosh. That is so cool. And it's three, and I think all different different heights yeah wow is it called it like a graduated set or something yeah that'd be quite cool for the thanksgiving table as well because the talent <laughs> yes. it's almost like a turkey foot as well you know mm. you can pretend for thanksgiving it's a turkey foot they are very very cool they are really cool i'm also thinking maybe colored candles in it orange i'm thinking black or like a dark Ooh, gray like a charcoal empire. Mm. full empire i was going exactly autumnal Probably because I'm wearing this scarf now and it's right. feel very snugly. This has not got um, a note on it, so no clues this time. Ooh, well, that's a gorgeous print. Spode Creatures of Curiosity tea towel. Oh. You know Spode Creatures of no, Curiosity? No, I don't. Oh, and there's two. No, I don't know it either. Hang on. Let's, let's we can always up. use tea towels. Well, that's one thing. Tea towels. We just use so many on a daily basis. Yeah. This is beautiful. It's massive as I well. I love the print. Isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful. Yeah, I really like that. I like the butterflies on it. Creatures of curiosity. I can't believe I didn't know about this print. I That's wonder if beautiful. they do tablewares in it. Oh, nice tablecloth in that. Yeah, it's really nice. We have stunning backdrop mm -hmm. for something. And we have two. These are going to be fabulous in the kitchen. Actually, quite good for you because you do spend a lot of time polishing. Polishing. Mm. It's not so much drying as polishing. I, I, so you can look at the. It's very for thorough. Hours whilst you thoroughly, thoroughly polish. I'm actually lucky to have a man in my life who polishes everything, makes it pretty. <laughs> it's true. Oh, Stephanie, silver and citrine fit for a queen. Oh. Which rhymes? I'm actually just super excited about the fabric that it's, it's wrapped fabric. in. Well, oh, it's wrapped in. a minute, but look at this. Oh. Can we see the front? Sorry, sorry, I was so excited. <laughs> what can we use that for? It's beautiful. I don't know what for, but I think cushions maybe? Maybe. It'd be lovely as a... Pop of colour. Yeah, maybe we can make some cushions for the um, seat outside, for the, the terrace uh, seating oh, area. that's a really good idea. It's I'm very gonna, happy and cheerful. just on the outside chairs. Yeah. Or it'd be lovely as a little, little tablecloth with some of the spurred on top. I think, no, I think your first idea, I really yeah. like the idea of outdoor cushions with that. Good. It's just so pretty. Yeah, I'm trying to drape things so that you can see them as I'm opening them. Oh, no, I had this still. Mm -hmm. I was so excited about the fabric it was wrapped in. What is it? Oh, and there's another thing in here as well. My goodness. Oh, 
Okay, I'm oh, going to put girl. it. On, I'm going to put it on um, on here because I think it's going to look incredible against the green. That's very elegant. It's gorgeous, isn't it? It's beautiful. And wow! Oh wow! Oh gosh! It's incredible. That's a statement necklace. Oh yes, I like a good statement necklace. Actually, it's really cool with the little round thing. I think it's beautiful. It's stunning. Again, it's a very simple black top. It's really nice with like sort of like basket weave pattern on the... No, it's gorgeous. I love it. And you know I love citrine so much. Mm -hmm. I cannot believe how thoughtful everything that you've sent is. It was still not through. Jay or Ziggy? I'm not sure. <laughs> Who's picked out what? Which would you say? Oh. I'll go on then. <laughs> These are cameos. Actually, that man looks very familiar. I wonder if it says who he is. D does anybody recognise who the people are? Aren't they delicate? I mean, the details. Yes. I just do not Can't figure out who they are. They, but there's someone else as well. A very beautiful woman. I mean, it doesn't say at all on the back. No clue. So these are going to be added to the Wedgwood collection. Mm -hmm. See, Stephanie and Philip, one can never have too many of these. All oh, right. Too many what? But can we not have too much of? I don't know. It's stunning. It is another trinket box. Do you know what we need to do, Philip? We need to up our quantity of trinkets. <laughs> I think we've got plenty of trinkets, darling. <laughs> oh, oh good I know that's that is unbelievable. Uh, okay, apparently we now we now have trinkets. I can't wait to see what they are. Okay, the trinkets are amazing. Look at it's that. Beautiful. And this one. Oh, the little bee. Yeah, and it's um sunflower. I love sunflowers. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, this I think is going to be <laughs> absolute staple next summer. Nice. That's a classic. But this one, I can't wait to show you this one. I think this is the best trinket. Look how happy that Oh, was. I love that Philip's one. Face. Philip's face just went... <gasps> he's so cute. I know, he's so happy. He's just the happiest mouse. With the berries. There's he's in, got in, all the berries. There's a photographer on Instagram who well. photographs mice eating from flowers and such. Okay. That's I, so I don't know cute. It. Okay, this one's going straight on. And he can just be getting on with his berry stealing over here. He's very happy. Oh, Philip. Oh, no. I love it. Love it. And I'm super excited about the trinkets, but I've just been staring at the books and just that background lattice yes. work. It's called Pastimes, apparently. Pastimes? Oh, the actual box. Well, yeah, that's what it said underneath. I adore it. Look at that. Mm. Well, we can decide where that's going to go. Oh, oh. I think it's a manicure set. That is very useful. Let's have a look. Uh, oh, yeah, wow. Oh, okay. This is amazing. That is, you have no idea how important this is. I've got only just uh, two. Oh, that's for cuticles. That's why I don't have a cuticle one. I have two this size and the big one's still fine, but the little one's got really blunt and I was having difficulty cutting my Gosh. nails with it the other day. What is all of it for? It's all for, for nails then. That's well, a fine. I realise that I have never maybe done enough to my nails now. I don't, I don't think I've ever use anything like that on my nails do you think that's for the little bits of skin that like poke out i don't know what's this for I... shaving now i have to learn how to use the manicure set it's very i can't exciting. be shaving as a manicure <laughs> and this one what is that for i i don't know why have i never used this before no i think my nails are in such a state <laughs> i think you should look it up I will do. I'm loving this. And all yellow. Gosh, you love this. No note on this one. Everything is so beautifully wrapped. I know. It looks so beautiful together as well. It's very much Marie's aesthetic, I think. Oh, yeah. The brown paper packages mm -hmm. tied up with string. A few of your favourite things. Of your favorite things. <laughs> so I think that I now have new favourite Christmas decorations. Oh, they're cool. And uh, Gisela Graham, she always does incredible, incredible Christmas decorations. But this... Does she have a shop? Uh, it's, a, it's a make and then they sell them in most no, shops. But does she have like a... Uh... Yeah, she's got her own, actually. Oh. We should find out. Mm. Isn't that just that the is finest excellent. Christmas decoration? On our like peachy, pinky tree. Yes. <gasps> and this one is huge. Is that a chandelier? A candelabra? Okay. Best Christmas decorations. Love that. I've never seen these patterns of hers. No, me neither. The token with the top hat is excellent. Well, that's you. Yes. And that's me. Exactly. 
with my sort of Amazonian feather crown. Mm. Oh, yeah. The one that you usually wear. Oh, yeah, that one that I always wear <laughs> at Christmas. This is incredible. It's beautiful. Love it so much. Maybe I should have a little tree in my study this year. Maybe. Just a little one. Something to think about. Next one's for you. Thank you very much. From Jay and Ziggy. Oh, it's a little dog with a ball. Isn't that cute? Is that a brooch? I think so. He's adorable. He looks so excited, your face. You have the cutest face in the world. Isn't that super cute? Look at his little expression. He's smiling. Yeah. Actually, he looks just like you when you looked at him. He loves it because he's got his little ball. Philip, that is beautiful. Isn't Honestly, it, it really, like really you. suits you. No, it looks so good. He's so cute. And there's something, I think it might be, oh, it must be another manicure set. You've got a manicure set as well? I think so. It's quite heavy. Ooh. So like you, I've got oh. no clue what most of them are for, but I love this one. This is a so journey heavy. of discovery <laughs> that we can go on together, darling, with our manicure sessions in the evening. Nice. Look at that. I like the black. It's very yes. elegant, actually. Those little black nail scissors. I just know what they're for. I love the leather with the brown and then the black and all and the colours there. it's super elegant. It's and really I like that we have design. his and hers. Yes. But I know you love this. There's still two more parcels for me to open over here. All right, then. This one says a decorative egg. Why not? <laughs> because this one is looking very lonely right now. That is Strini's little friend. And he's got friends upstairs. That's actually. true. Little decorative egg collection up there now. My aunt used to collect them. Decorative eggs. Did she? Yeah, the entire yeah. section in there. Got me the very first one. It's the smallest one up there. I don't know if you know the tiniest little. Oh one. yeah, yeah. You got that for me when I was eighteen. Oh, Nin eighteen or nineteen? Yeah, that was the cute. first one, and the collection's grown. Because you thought you thought they were excellent eggs. Excellent. Oh, Philip. Am I eggs cruciating? Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh, that's for the kitchen. Wow. That is boom oh, for my the kitchen. Goodness. So gorgeous. Yeah. That's I'm so beautiful. sorry. My my stomach is rumbling. So I'm just <laughs> apologising. If anybody's here, rumblings in the background. If it's rambling, it's me. <laughs> rambling, <laughs> rambling me. I will have a biscuit after this. So but that's beautiful stuff. Love it. Goodness. Okay, I've we're putting that never seen an egg like that. Yes. And you've already taken through the blue ones because you were worried they were going to get broken. Mm -hmm. They're already in the kitchen. We'll add that to the in a moment. They could put the egg in, into one of the cups, like standing up. Uh, yeah, we can try. We can try lots of different things with the egg. Actually, I think you might be right because right? it's really pretty that way around. Yeah. Okay, okay, we'll give that a shot. <laughs> and this is the final gift from. I can't Zippy believe how many there have been. I cannot believe it. Your generosity is just yeah. unbelievable. And it's all things that we would have picked out ourselves. To Stephanie, something simple and elegant. <gasps> Oh. oh. Oh my goodness. Oh, it is. Okay. I love it. Absolutely. Oh. It goes with what you're wearing. It's got a very Hermes feel to it. Yeah. It? Stirrups. It's, it's a very equestrian, I was going to say. I love it. I'm putting it on straight away. And yes, I am going to wear it. Ah, well, I would put it on straight Ah, yes, yes, yes. Do no, you I'm the hand? I'm all over this now. Are you? Ish, yeah. No, <laughs> I've got it. I've got it. This is dexterity training. Dexterity. Are you, telling, are you encouraging your fingers? Oh, did it. Look at that. It's beautiful, Angel. I love it. Oh, thank you so much. And thank you for everything. I mean, this is going to be me of an evening. I'm sorry, I just uh, I don't feel it's showing enough. Like that. With my little espresso. Thank you. Right, really. I can't thank you enough, Jay and Ziggy, because I, I really do think it's probably Ziggy that chose most of this. And Ziggy, you did a great job. Thank you so much. It's time for the last parcel of the day. And, oh, I hope there's a note. I can't see it. This looks really fun. Oh, Kirsty. This is an excellent penguin, by the way. I, oh, gosh, that's cute. All the Ar Antarctic explorers. Okay, I'll take There's a note there. Yes. Right, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Here we go. That's gorgeous. Fairchild's Dictionary of Fashion. Isn't that beautiful? Hi, Stephanie. I am a creative with ponchos, and Chico de Mayo is soon. Well, it, it's quite soon. <laughs> it was quite we're, soon. We're getting towards it. Yes. Uh, so people can choose whatever they like, please. Poncho Power on the Charlotte Fairchild YouTube channel. All right. Oh, 
Hang on, let's put this down. Like a good poncho. I love a good poncho, and I, actually, we are coming into poncho weather. Mm-hmm. It, it, it is poncho is weather. Are they penguins? I think so. Or is that yin and yin? They're penguins. They are actually penguins. This is a penguin poncho. This is amazing. It looks very soft. Oh, it's super soft. Hang on, let's put the seam on the side. Um, do the penguins suit me? Do very I'm much so. Some penguin will flare. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, they're very cute. I can see myself editing in this, actually. Yeah, I can imagine. say we could each choose our favourites, and I think it's going to be hard to beat this one for me. <laughs> you always like the... Winter editing penguins. You always love the fact that I... Um, so in Dutch, penguin is penguin. Penguin. It's so cute, isn't it? So he always goes, penguin. It's because the word is so similar. I always said a Dutch word, which is... Darling. Little penguins. Let's have a look at the other punctures. <laughs> There's so many of them. I think this one is going to be very popular in the house because... All the Paris stuff. It's French. It's all Paris. Isn't that wonderful? So that seems very, very fitting. And I have my eye on this one, Philip, because I think this is made from um, bedding. Oh. And it's so similar to our bedding. Hang on, let me try. I love the lace detail. It's hard to remove the penguin. <laughs> Penguins can go That one looks in very study. warm, the penguins one. And I was wondering about, could this be a bed jacket? Because it does match our bedding. That's what true. What do you think? For those chill evenings. Oh, it's rather... Rather sexy, <laughs> with the uh, the shoulder action. And, it's very elegant. Um, I just need a good book with it, but luckily there is a book in here. Murder on the Silver Comet Trail, Charlotte Fairchild. So you wrote this, Charlotte. A scenic trail and friendly family walk combine to bring a shock by a surprise finding. Here are the building blocks of the book. Now add an inquisitive dog, a friend who believes in psychic powers, a metal detector, and strange men who challenge the women walking on the trail. How do these things fit together? Read Charlotte's book to find out. Oh. So this will be me in bed in winter. Please imagine the sexy shoulders. <laughs> With a good book. Oh. The half-naked man sitting by the mailbox seemed oblivious to the two women walking the leaf-strewn trail. Did you say you've well, got mail? Well, well. <laughs> Thank you so much, Charlotte. So I will be very snugly both in the bedroom and whilst editing. And I think everyone else can be too because this one is super, super soft. And then there's another one that I think is bedding inspired. Oh my goodness! Oh, the penguins! I didn't look in the penguin bag. Oh, oh, he's going oh, to the Christmas decorations. Yes. He's going to come out every Christmas. There we go. Creature tree, mm -hmm. a very welcome addition. I think this is a scarf. Oh, I'm going to be honest. I'm not a hundred percent certain. Might be nice to your mother. Actually, she'll love the colour. But also, I think it might be like a sort of hooded scarf. Huh. Rather chic. And then hang on, I'll put that here. This is an entire bag. Of penguins. Oh yes. <laughs> if you thought he was going to be alone at Christmas, you were very much. There's a little penguin. penguin family. Oh. We have an entire chorus line of dancing <laughs> penguins here, ready for Christmas. One of them has forgotten to wear a bow tie. We may need to fashion one. He might him. be in charge. He, he might be the, the, the soloist. Oh uh, yes, uh, yes, of course. This, like, this is the, the backup. backup. <laughs> exactly. So creature tree has grown mightily in penguins, and we have something from Frozen. What's his name? Oh, Olaf. Oh, he is a jouet pour chien. Oh. Which is a very chic French way of saying dog toy. So either we need to get a dog. Good ideas. Or we give it to Molly. Molly. Mm. Though I do know you're starting to really, really wear me down. Am I? Just say, wearing me down. Well, we might need to get on that then. Get about that another time. Mm. Thank you so much, Charlotte. And thank you also to Jay and Ziggy and the mystery sender of the garden book. It's been a most glorious afternoon. I love how you're holding the penguin like a microphone. <laughs> yeah, well, I uh, I do need a penguin microphone <laughs> at all times. Does have a certain certain flair for a mm -hmm. microphone, I think. Good stage presence. Yes, he might take over, actually. Anyway, <laughs> it's actually him speaking. Oh, is it? Yeah, there's no one in the background. <laughs> Thank you to everyone. We've had the best afternoon sitting here opening presents. Yes. It has been really, really lovely to be back doing this. And thank you to everyone watching, because it's because of all of you that we're able to send all of the ad revenue from this channel to different charities. And we will let you know soon which of the charities we have chosen for this year. We are coming quite close to the end of Caddo, because as you know, we're no longer opening gifts that are arriving now. We still have a few that arrive before the cutoff of June to open. I think it will see us 
nearly until Christmas. I mean, yeah. There'll be a few more weeks. We are going to do a Christmas special. Yeah, so whatever happens, we will end with a big Christmas special at the end of the year. Lots and lots of love to all of you. Thank you for joining us again. Can't wait to see you again next week. Bye from Lalan. Bye-bye.